about 270 million years ago, the lineage of therapsids was already reshaping life on land. But among them, a group called cynodonts marked a decisive step toward the mammals we know today. Therapsids had moved away from the sprawling gait of earlier pelicosaurs, but cynodonts pushed this further with more upright limbs and stronger, more efficient movement and advantage for active hunting and sustained activity. Their skulls show a remarkable transformation. The lower jaw, once made of several bones, was becoming dominated by a single dentary bone, while smaller bones at the rear gradually reduced in size and would later form the three middle ear bones unique to mammals. Their teeth evolved into specialized sets. Incisors for cutting, canines for piercing, and molars for grinding allowing them to chew and process food instead of merely swallowing chunks. This meant more energy could be extracted from the same meal. Fossil evidence also reveals changes in the nasal region, the presence of ridges where turbinates could attach suggests these animals were evolving the ability to warm and humidify incoming air, a key step toward endothermy. Studies of synodont bone microstructure reveal dense blood vessel networks, consistent with higher metabolic rates. By the late Permian and into the Triassic, synodonts had diversified into both small insectivores and larger predators, adapting to ecosystems in recovery after the end Permian mass extinction. Every structural change in jaw mechanics, teeth, posture, and respiratory adaptation was a building block in the blueprint that would ultimately give rise to mammals.